Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Before we start the video, please don't forget to follow my Roblox account and join my group. Also, I'd really appreciate it if you were to like and subscribe and also turn on post notifications so you know every time I upload a Roblox video. In this video, I'm going to be giving you my best tips on how to get really rich in Adopt Me in the most fastest way possible. So let's get into the video. So my first tip is to log into Adopt Me every single day. Here you can see all the rewards, including the golden egg, which you can guaranteed open a legendary in and you can collect all these rewards by getting stars from logging in every single day right now my high streak is 107 days and i'm currently on 36 days the more consistent days you log in you get more stars and you even earn bucks every single day which can help you get rich and get more pets if you manage to get a streak of logging in every single day you will literally earn more just by how many days you log in so that is my first tip on how to get rich literally just log in my next tip is to make a grind room or a grind house now i'm pretty broke in adobe bucks right now as you can see but this is my grind room and this is literally all you need you can make your grind room look however you want but you just need some places where where your pets can eat and drink, sleep, have a bath, and also some pianos for the playground task. So grand rooms are really useful because you have everything that you need in one room, and you'll only have to leave the house for the camping, hospital, school, and pool party task. Even though grinding can be boring, I suggest to watch YouTube or Netflix whilst grinding or even play with some friends to make it less boring. My next tip on how to get rich is to buy eggs and hatch them. Now in Adopt Me there are many eggs that you can buy, but I definitely recommend to buy the danger eggs right now as they are leaving the game soon. I don't recommend to buy these royal eggs because they are really expensive with only an 8% chance of getting a legendary. And it's still quite hard to hatch a legendary even when it's that expensive. I don't recommend buying the pet eggs either because you still have a low chance of getting a legendary and they still are quite expensive. I do recommend buying the cracked eggs because they are really cheap and you can buy more of them. Even though you have a low chance of getting a legendary, it still is possible and you can still get some good pets. I only have one danger egg right now, but the eggs I would recommend to buy are the eggs in the gumball machine and the cracked eggs. And don't be sad if you don't get a legendary on your first few tries. Just keep going, you will end up getting it eventually. My next tip is to actually learn values and learn the values of your pets. Now you can actually become poor in Adopt Me if you do bad trades. For example, this is a good trade because they offered four of the same neons plus two extra neons, which I could just make a mega again and then I can get these two neons basically for free now i traded my mega crow for all of these megas and at the time i'm happy with this trade like i'm really happy with this trade but all my friends were saying it's bad because these megas are low and they're kind of hard to trade so be careful of what trades you do and make sure that the pets you're training for aren't hard to trade but i don't have much regrets for this trade because i'd rather all these megas than just a mega crow but if you're looking to grow your inventory then don't do trades like this my next tip is to not overpay for any new pets or items that come into adopt me if you overpay for anything new in adopt me then the demand will get less over time and your pet won't be worth as much in a few days time as more people would have got them also do not buy pets in the store because they are crazily over overpriced you can buy a road potion for just 150 robux and you can trade it for any low legendary pet so whatever you do don't buy a pet using robux and don't overpay for new items now my last and final tip is to actually spend time on adopt me i know people that get upset and angry because they haven't got a good inventory just for playing for 10 minutes a day if you want to get rich in adopt me then you have to play a lot i've had many sleepless nights staying up late grinding pets to make megas and neons but you don't have to do this every day just like every once in a while just grind some pets up and make new megas and neons that you want and it will all be worth it in the long run because this will work for everyone well i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you in the next video goodbye everyone